Audrey, today is the day. I'm marrying you. Hi, Austin. A. Houston. It's A. Audrey. I love you so much and cannot wait to see you. Audrey, from the first time I met you to this moment, I have been the luckiest guy on the face of the earth. I thank God for putting a woman that is so caring, so generous, so beautiful inside and out. I'm so excited for the future. You are going to represent to all of us, to the church, to the outside community, of what it means to be Christ married to his church. Austin, I remember the days when I used to pray to God that I would find this great spouse. I never in a million years would have thought he would lead me to the best human in the whole world, and that's you. So happy for you, so proud of both of you and the life you've started to create together, and we look forward to being part of every second of it. I love our love. It's a love with an incredible sense of humor, a love rooted deep in our souls, a love tied to God himself. I vow to always grow that love in any way I can. I don't know why I gave you much, I'm not getting there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Austin, I'm going to marry you. You are always willing to work out any problem or try something new. No matter what happens, you always make it a point to make me your priority and say I love you every day. Oh, <laughs> Thank you all for being here. It means a lot. Oh, my. You are stunning. Look how great you look. Oh, I'm so happy. You so good. Oh, stunning. Beautiful. I vow to keep learning with you growing with you and experiencing all of God's creation with you. I vow to do the small things that add up in a big way. I vow to always give you that good night kiss, the cuddle on the couch after a long day of work, to do all the things to show you I appreciate you. It's the first time I think I've ever married a couple where the groom asked me to pray with them. Can we do a quick prayer? Can you pray with All right. Heavenly Father, be with our friend Austin and Audrey today as they come together to become one, to show the love of what it is for Christ and his church to each other. May you bless them with children and all the things that come with matrimony. We ask that you bless them today in the name of the Father and the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs> that was incredible. I love you for your positivity, the way you light up a room. You surprise me, appreciate me, communicate with me, put in an immense amount of effort, your confidence, thoughtfulness, and you never put me down. You only make me a better person in every way. Oh, you're the biggest badass I know. <laughs> oh, my honey. That's so cute. <laughs> love is patient, love is kind. It is not jealous, it is not pompous. It is not inflated, it is not rude. It does not seek its own interests. It is not quick-tempered. It does not brood over injury. It does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices within the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails. You are the best thing that's ever happened to me, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Uh, so I love you, and can't wait to see you here in a few hours. Awesome. I just love you so much, and there's no words for it. I'll see you at the altar. I love you. I cannot wait to see you walk down that aisle. You are going to look absolutely beautiful. We have come rejoicing into the house of the Lord to, for this celebration, dear brothers and sisters. 
And now we stand with Austin and Audrey on the day they intend to form a home of their own. I often wish I met you earlier in life because I know even with spending the rest of our lives together from this moment forward, that time still won't be enough. I vow. I, I vow to always make our time together on this earth meaningful. So as we embark on this marriage, the highs and lows, let's remember how we feel today, the love and support we have in this room and to never lose that spark. I love you, Audrey. First of all, I vow to pray with you and for you in order to grow our relationship together and with God. I love you more than anything on this earth Austin Berklin, and you are my world. I, Austin, take you, Audrey, to be my wife. I, Audrey, take you, Austin, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. It is now my great honor to present to you, Mr. and Mrs. Berkeley. I love our love. It's a love with an incredible sense of humor, a love rooted deep in our souls, a love tied to God himself. I vow to always grow that love in any way I can. I'm so proud of both of you and have a wonderful, wonderful lifetime together. We love you so much. Audrey's family has been part of this community for 150 years and we're still going. <laughs> It means a lot to us and Audrey and Austin that all of you have come to be part of this celebration and to share it all with us. So thank you very much. It didn't take long at all for any of us to see that Austin was the one. We got to spend so much time with him during quarantine, holidays, trips, and countless other memories. AB, is, as we call him, is the life of the party. They complement each other so well, have so much fun together, are the best of friends, and I know will be the perfect partners to share life's journey. I just married the love of my life. Um, we did it in front of our family and friends and our loved ones, and I could not be happier. I could not envision a life that had this much happiness. I really appreciated the, the, the note you guys left on our table before the reception started. Congrats, AB Squared. Love the harms us. Can't wait to party tonight. Love you guys. You guys are awesome. I think you're gonna be an awesome couple. And go Cubs, go! Go Cubs, go! Reba McIntyre is your niece. We hope you have a really good life and a happy life. I love you, Austin and Audrey. You're my thankful girls, my thankful boys. This is Nappy Boy Radio. AB Yachty is a first ballot Hall of Famer. Love you guys. Great day. Seriously. And you guys made me cry at your wedding because your love for each other is just the most pure thing in the world and I absolutely love it. You two don't make the long haul, then love isn't real. The cards were very, very, very good. Just a beautiful ceremony for two beautiful people. Michelle and I have been married 32 years. Becky and Dave have been married 42 years. We all wish the two of you as many good memories and life experiences as both of your parents. I am 
very happy and proud of how their relationship continues to grow and they truly bring out the best qualities in each other. I said she will fit in just fine in this family. That is a direct quote. So I want to wish you guys the best and uh, love you guys. Best wedding ever. Baby! All the 14 drinks, Steve. Riggins. Kurt wishes that big dog Riggins was hanging out with you guys. I love you guys. My favorite part of the wedding today was when Audrey walked down the aisle and Austin got to see her for the first time. Love it. It's been real. Damn, you guys are married.